we also know that men are attracted to variety and may be tempted by someone new and exciting. Once we introduce you to our family, there's no turning back. Once we are yours, then we are yours forever. <laughs> no return, no exchange. Hey everyone, how are you all doing? So for today's video, we will be diving into a topic that some of you may find it interesting and perhaps even relatable and maybe some of you <laughs> will not relate to this. Now, if you are an expat who is in a relationship with a Filipina or is married to a Filipina, you might know this feeling that you got from your wife or girlfriend for that matter a feeling that she's so overly protective of you like she's barricading you of something or rather from someone now a lot of you might wonder and say that maybe the reason she's very protective of me or of you is because she is very infatuated with you or that she is deeply in love with you and wants to keep you all to herself. Well, that can be true. We Filipinas want you for ourselves only and will do whatever it takes to make sure we have you. I mean, you can call it possessiveness or love, but sometimes there are reasons as to why Filipinas are very protective of their possessions, I call it. <laughs> anyway, just a quick disclaimer. I am not saying that all Filipinas are like this, but certainly there are Filipinas out there who do feel like this due to cultural norms, personal experiences, or individual personality traits. And I am not trying to generalize an entire population or so. So with that, let's get on with it. So the first reason why Filipinas will be overprotective of their foreign husbands or boyfriend is because we know that there are a lot of competitions out there. And when it comes to beauty, we can't deny the fact that Filipinas do have an exotic look. We have a petite body and even our personalities are often charming. And in the Philippines, there's no shortage of good looking, sexy Filipinas. And well, every Filipina knows it. And that's one of the reasons why there are a lot of experts coming to the Philippines. It's because of women, come on. <laughs> and when you come to the Philippines, you will be surrounded by admirers waiting for your next move so that they can make their first move too. And with so many competitors vying for your attention, no wonder your Filipino girlfriend is very protective of you. It's like a dating jungle in the Philippines. And we Filipinas want to make sure that our husband or our partner stays the king of the jungles. And in the Philippines, it doesn't matter if you are in a relationship or not. If a Filipina sees you and wants you for herself, She's going to do everything in her power just to seize you. And while these Filipinas, I call them the snakes, because <laughs> even if you are with your Filipino wife or girlfriend, these snakes will try to steal you away from her by giving you this lewd look, seducing you with the use of their eyes, and showing off their <laughs> big melons. I mean, these snakes, they have no sense of boundaries. 
they'll try to win you for themselves just because they want to. And these Filipinas, they think that if they can steal you away from your partner or your wife, then they must be very desirable, right? And well, they can think to themselves that they can get whoever they want and however they want to. And sometimes there are certain occasions wherein the Filipina is already married and they have kids already with a foreign partner or, or a local, they still compete for other foreigners' attention. Even though they know that that expat or that foreign guy has already a girlfriend or a wife. So Filipinas know how conniving other Filipinas can be. So we try our best to keep you and protect you from other Filipinas. And another thing to keep in mind is that having a third party in a relationship in the Philippines is rampant. And that's actually one of the most common reasons why relationships between both locals and foreigners fail. So yes, Filipinas are very protective of their husbands or boyfriends because of these reasons. So don't be shocked when you feel that your wife or your girlfriend is overly protective of you. I mean, they're just doing it so that they can protect the relationship she has with you. But you know what they say? Competition can spice things up. So if your Filipino partner is a bit protective, <laughs> it might just be her way of ensuring she's your number one. And who can blame her? After all, love makes us do crazy things, right? And another reason why we Filipinas can be overly protective of our husband or boyfriend for that matter is because of insecurity. And as I mentioned already, Filipinas, we have a distinct beauty that is exotic and charming in so many ways. And we often worry that our partner may be tempted by someone else. And we feel the need to constantly guard and protect our relationship. We Filipinas know that there are other Filipinas out there that can outshine us when it comes to physical appearance. And <laughs> well, we also know that men are attracted to variety and may be tempted by someone new and exciting. We Filipinas also have these constant battles in our minds about what does he see in me and whether we truly measure up to the beauty standards set by the society. And we constantly wonder if we can keep the attention of our foreign husband or partner without them feeling the need to look for someone new, someone young, someone who has a petite body, and someone who can fulfill all his needs. And we often wonder if we are enough for our boyfriend and if we can truly satisfy them in every aspect of their lives. So yes, we Filipinas have this insecurity in us because we know that we can be easily replaced. I mean, with so many beautiful Filipinas around us, we do feel the need to be very protective towards our relationship and our partner. And we know that temptations are just lurking around and are ready to attack. And yes, we know that you guys, men, 
our visuals. So yes, we do have this need in us to be very protective towards you. And last but not the least, the reason why Filipinas are overly protective is because we are afraid of losing our loved ones. Filipinas are known to be deeply invested and committed to a relationship or marriage. That's why there are also a lot of passport bros or expats that are retiring to the Philippines and are looking for, uh, to find a wife because these foreigners, they know that Filipinas don't just leave the family or the relationship. Filipinas that are in a relationship or have a family already don't just go around screwing and breaking the family just because we are unhappy or tired of our partner. We Filipinas are well known for being family oriented and having a tight knit community and the fact that we know that there are Filipinas out there who are ready to break our relationship means that we Filipinas can come off as very protective or obsessive or possessive, however you call it. Because we are afraid of losing you or the relationship, breaking it. So our overprotectiveness might just be our way of saying, I can't bear the thought of losing you. Also, you guys have to remember that once we introduce you to our family, there's no turning back. Once we are yours, then we are yours forever. <laughs> no return, no exchange. And if we have problems in the relationship, it will not break up easily, but instead we will fix it. And that's how you make the relationship last. Plus remember, once we introduce you to our family, we Filipinas feel ashamed towards our family and friends once they know that you and her broke up. It's like losing a trophy. So please, to those foreigners who are not ready to be in a long-term relationship, just make sure that you are very vocal about it towards your girlfriend because, <laughs> well, it can be very painful once we lose you. So there you have it, folks. These are just some of the reasons why Filipinas are very protective towards their foreign husband or partner. So I know that there are other reasons out there too. I just did not want to <laughs> compile it in one video because it can be very boring. So yeah. I thank you everyone for watching these vlogs. I thank you all for the continuous support that I get, even though I rarely <laughs> upload videos now. But well, I thank you everyone for watching this vlog. I really do appreciate it, you all. And belated Merry Christmas and advance Happy New Year. So God bless us all and stay safe out there. Bye.